thanks for giving me the opportunity uh, to speak on my good friend, Sir Anne O'Neill. Uh, I'm going to introduce Cahill, her grandson over here. Cahill's going to sing the first song. And her two grandchildren, her two grand, she has loads of grandchildren. Two granddaughters are down here in the fourth row, Kira and uh, Mary. And Ashling is here, and her daughter, Noelle, is in the fourth row also. And maybe Noelle will sing later on in the presentation. Um, so would you please welcome Cahill O'Neill. And Cahill's going to sing the, f oh, sorry. Hi. Yeah, Cahill, Cahill's going to sing the first song. One evening fair to take the air, alone I chance to stray. Down by a silvery winding stream that ran along the way, I overheard a maid complain as the tears fell from her eyes. Send my love is on the ocean wide, bound for America. John Riley was my true love's name. He lived near the town of Bray. He was as fine a young man as ever you did see. My father, he had riches, while Riley, he was poor. And because he was a fisherman, they could not him endure. Her mother took her by the hand, and this to who heard it said, if you be fond of Riley, you must shun his company. Here is one hundred pounds in gold, and it can all be used. Send Riley to America, and you can follow too. When Eileen got the money, to Riley she did go, saying this very night, for to take your life, my father's charge is gone. Here is one hundred pounds in gold, my mother sent to you, so you sail for. America, and I will follow you. It was early then next morning that young Riley sailed away. But before he put his foot on board, these words he then did say, Here is a token of true love, and we'll break it now in two. Here is a ring and half my heart until I find out you. It was three or four months after she was walking down by the quay. When Riley he come back again for to take his love away. The ship was wrecked, all on board was lost, and her father grieved full sore. He found Riley in her arms, and both were drowned on the shore. He found a letter on her breast and it was wrote with blood saying cruel was my father who thought he would shoot my love 
Let the snow be a warning to all young maidens fair, for to never let the lad say love sail to a bear again.